NSJ bloke here, and today I'm wearing a pair of red nylon spandex jeans. These are also known as disco pants from American Apparel. So today I'm wearing these red nylon spandex jeans because, you guessed it, I've got a clip from a TV show where someone is wearing red nylon spandex jeans. So we'll be matching today. But the good news is I also have a second clip and both of these clips are from the same TV show. So let me tell you a little bit about what TV show this is. This is from a show from the 1980s, of course, called T.J. Hooker, which was a police drama that ran from 1982 to 1986. Now, both of these clips that I have here today, they are from season three, which was in 1983. So both episodes came out in 1983, less than two months apart from each other. So let's get into this first episode right here. This one was broadcast on October 8th, 1983, and it was called Carnal Express. Now, in this clip, we have somebody wearing red nylon spandex jeans. And the person wearing the red nylon spandex jeans is none other than Heather Locklear, who was a star of the show. Now, she plays a police officer named Stacy Sheridan, and in this episode, she goes undercover to do some work for the police department. So we see her in red nylon spandex jeans. Unfortunately, we don't get all that great coverage of her red disco pants, but we get to see a little bit of her walking away and then sitting at a table. It's uh, nice nonetheless, even though it's short. Oh, and by the way, as she is walking towards the table, we can see that big trapezoidal tag over the right pocket of her pants, which clearly means that the pants are either a Bojingles or a Legambi brand. So anyways, why don't we roll that clip right now and watch it together, and then when it's over, we'll come back and talk about it. Now, fill out this application. Don't leave any of the questions blank, okay? You can uh, fill it out over there. Hi. Hi. I'm Stacy. I'm Shirley. I guess you're applying for a job, too. Hmm. One look and I can see you don't belong here any more than I do. Times are tough. Good luck. Good luck to you, too. Not from what I see. All right, so what'd you think of that one? A bit short, wasn't it? But the pants were very nice looking. Yes, they were. So in this episode, as I mentioned, she goes undercover to do some police work. And uh, she's going undercover as a dancer. Okay, so usually with a lot of the other clips that we've seen in previous episodes of MSJ Bloke. You know, the people wearing nylon spandex jeans are kind of like shady or they're doing CD type of work. In this episode, at least she's going as a dancer. Some people probably still frown on that profession, but I say it's, you know, it could be worse as we've seen in many other episodes. So anyway, that's about it there. We don't get to see her anymore in those red pants. I do like to wonder why she would have a pair of red nylon spandex jeans. Do you suppose it belongs to her? Or was it part of one of the items that the police station would have for, for their officers to go undercover? I'm betting the pants belong to her because she was pretty young. And again, that was 1983. Disco pants were still very popular. So, it's something to think about. And I like to think about that too because that means that she was a good person who wore nylon spandex jeans. And we can never see enough of that. Anyway, let's move on to the next episode. Uh, as I mentioned, this one aired just less than two months after the one we just saw. This one here aired on December 3rd, 1983, and it's called Blue Murder. 
Now in this episode, there is somebody wearing black nylon spandex jeans. And I particularly like how these pants look. Plus, we get a lot better view of these pants than we got of the red ones in the previous episode. So, why don't we just go ahead and watch this one and once it's over we'll come back and talk about it now the good thing about this one also is that it's a little bit longer than the first one so we have more to see here so let's go ahead and watch it and then we'll come back and talk about it on the other side Gloria, open up, please. You take the stairs to the roof. Take it easy. I didn't do anything. Nobody said you did. I know what you cops did to Sweet Willie. Please don't. What are you talking about? I saw it. One of you shot him and the other just stood there and watched. All right, how did you like that one? I really like that one myself. I love the way those pants look. For some reason, they appear to be uh, super shiny, extremely form-fitting on her. I like that fit. Again, that is how these pants should fit if you're going to wear them. I didn't mention it, but um, I like the way that uh, Heather Locklear's red ones fit her as well. Again, a very good fit, even though we didn't get to see too much of it. But these black ones, just amazing. I really love the way these pants look. Now, the interesting thing is I wasn't really sure that these were nylon spandex jeans. Um, they looked a little bit too shiny and also because of the way that she was dressed they kind of looked like athletic apparel she was kind of dressed anyway to me in a way that looked like she was going to the gym I don't know that's why I wasn't sure I thought maybe pants were just tights and not actual balance pants jeans but when we got to see her running up on the roof I noticed that the lower legs of her pants, they were straight leg, just like actual nylon spandex jeans from that era were, you know? They're not like these that are super skinny all the way down. They were actually looser down here. And that's one thing that convinced me that they were actually disco pants. But another thing was um, initially when we see her um, go running outside of her room through the window. I didn't see any pockets on those pants. So that's another reason I wasn't sure that they were nylon spandex jeans. So I uh, froze the video and those couple of scenes there where she's exiting her room through the window. And it was only when I froze those uh, frames that I was able to see that, yes, the pants had pockets. They were undeniably nylon spandex jeans. And not only that, but it appears that I could see some kind of a brand label above the right pocket. So I'm fully convinced that those were nylon spandex jeans. Probably some other brand other than, you know, the Lagambis, the Bojingles, 
the Fredericks. It was probably something else because the Shine was just a little bit more than those. And um, even the pocket designs, they didn't seem to have that rounded bottom like the ones that I mentioned do. So it was, you know, they were nylon spandex jeans though, nonetheless, and a great looking pair at that. Now, the only bad thing is that this character named Gloria, played by an actress named Gina Tomasina, or Tomasina, um, Gloria was unfortunately a street worker. And once again, it's Hollywood just trying to push that stereotype on us that it's only those kind of people who wear nylon spandex jeans. But we know better, don't we? All right, so those pants were again very nice. This was a much longer clip. We got to see the pants closer up and we also got to see full length shots. Those pants and that particular episode both were winners for me and uh, I really enjoyed seeing that. So I've been told that there is a third episode of this series that has somebody wearing nylon spandex jeans. I don't know. I would love to confirm that and find this third episode if it's really out there. The good thing about this series is that it is currently streaming on a website for free. The entire series from beginning to end you can watch every episode. I would love to do that, especially to find out this third episode, but that does take a lot of time. If any of you out there know about this third episode, let me know about it so I can make another video here. So anyway, I really hope that you enjoyed both of these clips today. I know I had a good time making this video and checking those out. If you did enjoy it, leave a thumbs up subscribe to the channel so you'll know when I have new videos up and until next time keep on rocking the nylon spandex jeans